so, so as of right now, my goals are to complete their aspirations, uh, to raise the kids, and to make more, uh, up to $100,000. We're not even all the way there yet. So we're gonna, that's my goal of at the moment, at the moment. Uh, my internet cut out, so if you answered this, I'm sorry, but what are we going to see the Vampire Twins again? Is that just for Halloween? I think it was a just for Halloween thing. They might return next Halloween. But at the moment, I'm not really feeling Vampire Twins anymore, unfortunately. Um, but who knows? I also said I, w I wasn't feeling this Let's Play again, and now I'm playing it again, so. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Um, yeah. Okay, so here we are. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Are they flirting? What's happening? Like, what was that? I don't know. <laughs> what are you doing there? He's gonna go check on Sage. Sage, don't go make a mess. No, ma no messes, please, Sage. Sage, 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 Sage. Go ask your dad to help you go potty, okay? Mom is having, it's 5 a.m. early morning on the farm. Mom is tired too, though. She needs to go to bed. Dad's gonna, gonna, he's, his uh, needs are perfect. Good job, dad. I can't believe I'm calling Archer dad. This is so cute. And Lavender is just having a, oh my gosh. She's <laughs> having a time. Sage is on her way up. How cute is she? So cute. Oh, we got some treats for Chewy. Thank you so much. All right, Mariana, here's a treat from you to Chewy. Say thank you, Chewy. This one's from Joy's May. Thank you, thank you. Oh, and this one's from Queen Verna. Give a little bye-bye. Good, that was, that was good, that was good enough. That was a good enough high five, Chewy, good job. <laughs> that was cute. We got some babies that are upset. Who is it? It's Ophelia. I think today we're, I think in this episode, we're gonna age the kids up. What do you guys think? Is it time to age up Sage into a kid and the twins into into children or toddlers? Let me know. Lifespan is still on long, uh, but I'm kind of over having these kids at this life stage. <laughs> yes, age them up. Okay, we'll age them up today on Tuesday. Then, okay, she's going to bed, good. Go to bed. Dad's working on potty training. What a king. What a king. Age them up. But well, we'd have three tots. No, no, no. We, we would age up Sage too. Sage would age up into a child. We would not have three tots. Absolutely would not happen. Just 100% no. 100% no. Oliver. Okay, Oliver is now good. Excellent, go to bed. There you go, mom. Ooh, it looks like Sage is upset. She's tired and she's hungry. Okay, let's give Sage, after she's done eating, give food to Sage. We'll give her some applesauce and then we'll send her to bed. 7 a.m., bedtime for Sage. Come here, Sage, here's your applesauce. And then why don't you clean, clean up that. Sage is gonna eat her. She's so cute. She's eating her applesauce. I like to pretend that they're the applesauce is uh all right, put her to put her to sleep now. I like to imagine the applesauce is like apples from their farm, even though it is not from their farm. Oop, Oliver is upset again. And his name is John, and his name is John Cena! Can't, I can't tell what his needs are here. Was that it? Maybe we'll bounce him a little bit too. Go to sleep. Archer's reading baby to bed. They're so cute. Watching while get ready for work. Yay, thank you, Storm. Uh, Dai Yala. Uh, Dai Yala? Apologies if I mispronounced your username. Thank you so much for four months. Is uh, Luna. Lunaria, thank you so much for tier one sub. Oops, wrong one. There is not a wild Oprah at the moment. Hold on. Welcome to our quest for world domination. Heck yeah. What would John Cena do? I don't know what he would do. Hopefully play some Sims. 
I think he follows me on on uh, on Twitter now, and I think he plays Sims. Oh, we got a baby up. We got a baby up. I'm sorry, Dad. This is the all you. Mom's been doing baby baby job for a minute. Okay. Okay. He's like, I love parenting. Look at him. He's so happy he's with his little people because he's extroverted. How flippin' cute are they? Oh. Ophelia is up and upset. Oh, they're both up and upset. Okay. All right. Who, what's going on here? How's Sage? Sage? Sage is like, I'm vibing. What are you doing, Sage? Go to sleep. She just got up to go to back to sleep. All right. Good for you. Basil's now a fully grown rooster. Good job, Basil. Oh, and Rose is saying she wants to go to GeekCon. I do not want to go to GeekCon, Rose. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We got a busy day on the farm today. You know, we got to, we got to like take care of uh, all of our stuff here. Collect some age, scatter some feed, you know, the usual. Woo, we're in our, oh, I love that we're in our little boots because it's raining outside. Archer took care of bebes so he can go back to sleep. Lavender's ready to go on the farm. It's noon. They kind of slept. They kind of stayed up through the night and then woke up. I'm trying to get them on a better schedule. I don't know if I have, though. Milkshake is good. Oh, milkshake. I can't believe we don't have our, our beloved drama queen anymore. Yeah, you can come over, Lavinia. That's fine. You know, we might be a little busy, but you can come over. Oh my God, did we just step in dog poo? We did. Oh, we can't pick it up anymore. Dang it. Dog always poos right outside. Did we get a cow? Yeah, our cow died last episode, so we had to get a new cow, unfortunately. It's very sad, but it is what it is. Oop. Oh, we got a clean milkshake. Milkshake's a little dirty. How's Snowflake doing? Snowflake's shed is a little dirty. And Milky Way's is Milky Way is clean. Oh, we got an upset Ophelia. Dad, this is all you. Dirty diaper move. He woke up flirty as usual. <laughs> oh, he's so flirty. Thank you, milkshake. Milkshake, we love it. We love to give some lovin's to Milkshake. Ooh, yeah, our house is in regulation. Ooh, we got plenty of things to harvest today. So much to do. Alia, thank you so much for 100 bits. Look at the hype train going. I'd love to see it. Mel made fools. Thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Elisa, thanks for 10 bits. Yeah. So, you know, John Cena, have you seen the Peacemaker opening? I have not seen the new, the Peacemaker uh, show yet, but it popped up the other day and I was like, I need to watch that. Have any of you guys seen it yet? Ophelia is such a beautiful name. I think so too. I think so too. Where's our dog? Yeah, Willow, Willow really does uh, only step one step outside of the door. <laughs> I love that Willow's. Willow's chasing her tail. She's the cutie. She really takes one step outside the door and said, this'll do, and poops right there. Snowflake has been unhappy. We literally just took care of you. Come here, Snowflake. Once we clean up, we're gonna talk to you and make sure you feel extra loved, okay? This is ridiculous. Oh, Oliver's upset. Dad! Oliver's upset. Go take care of him. Go take care of Oliver. Oh my God, look at little Sage. Wish she's gonna go watch mom. And mom's already oh, gone into another. So oh, but here's a, uh, our, our mayor is here. Oh, we got some things to evolve. Excellent, excellent. This one I think is to be evolved. Excellent. Wow, so many things. Very good. Oh, she's she's like coming over to watch her daughter. Where did her daughter go? She's her hygiene's like terrible. Okay, what do you? Yeah, you're un you're starving, but your feed is full. Okay, let's go take care of our our snowflake here. What is that? 
Did you just get a cocktail? A bottle of milk. Oh, okay. I don't know why that says bottle of milk and it looks like something else, but it is one apparently. She needs to pee. Oh shoot. Okay. Well, why don't you go pee really quick and maybe take a shower and dad can take over from here. All right. He's gonna, he's watching his daughter. Sage is fine. Sage can play with the animals. All right. You can, you can come clean Snowflake. Go take care of Snowflake. And his name is John Cena! More hype for the high trade, Aaliyah. Thank you so much. Ginger wife, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime or the Twitch sub. Uh, Laura, thank you so much for gifting a sub. A wild Oprah day. Heck yeah. Why do we always listen to Christmas music? I don't know. Um, but we got Dahlia, thank you so much for five whole months. A pink emerald, thank you so much for 11 months. One month away from a one year anniversary. Heck yeah! Can we finish level two of the hype train? Make sure to sub, gift those subs, use those bits, whatever. Uh, oh, Ophelia's mad. Oh man. I thought I told mom to like, to shower. She didn't, I don't know why. How are you feeling Snowflake? Snowflake's feeling a lot better now after some TLC. We're glad you, you know, you're, we're glad you told us that you weren't feeling well, Snowflake, but also, you know, okay. All right, this guy needs to use the bathroom as well. Lavender's, oh no, Fluffy and Bunny just died that someone in the household knew. I hope it wasn't Sage, but I have a feeling it was Sage who knew Fluffy. No, well, yeah, she knew more than one rabbit. So yeah, I do think it was Sage might be sad because of the because of the Fluffy that just died. Although none of them have a mood lit about it, so. Okay. What's that sound? Oh my gosh, Morgan! We got an Oprah! Morgan, two, six, two, three, eight, seven. Just gifted, not one, not two, but five gifted subs to the cult community. Welcoming new people into the danger zone and getting us to level three of the hype train. That is so exciting. Thank you so, so much for your generosity. Whoop, okay. Oh, wow, we're there talking. Nice, nice. He's feeling inspired. Oh, if you're inspired, you should play your piano. <gasps> what, he could write a song? Why don't you you play you uh, jazz up the place? Go play go play some music. And Lavender's gonna go watch her because he hasn't played in the new music room in a while. Okay, get it, boy. He's in the music room just living his life. Love that. Oh my God, his wife's right behind him listening. That's sweet. I love that. Okay. But there is a, there is a baby that's mad as usual. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go feed the baby. Uh -huh. Oh no, I don't need a job. Thank you. Who's playing in? Oh my God, you're playing in puddles again? No, 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 no. Also, why are there puddles in the house? Also, what is she doing? Just like. Okay, you need to lecture about this dog and playing. Stop playing in puddles, please. Yes, we'll learn not to play in puddles. Good job, Willow. Good job. Oh, Archer's gonna go take care of baby. That's good. He's like, I heard the baby. Don't get up. Don't don't get up, my darling wife. Let's give Willow a bath. Oh no, is she sick? She's sick. She's definitely on her period and she has dry skin. I think it might just be from her, her period. We need to get, maybe we'll just go to the wonderful store and we'll buy some stuff after we've washed the dog. Although it looks like Oliver's unhappy still. Are you not, are you not feeding Oliver? I thought you were gonna take care of him. Oh, okay. Apparently Oliver did not want that. Okay, there we go. All right, go get some food. No, go get some food, Archer. Is there no food to eat? Come on. Oh, 
Where is, where is the food? Oh, okay, there's no food in there. How's Sage? Oh, Sage is sad and tired. All right, go to sleep, Sage. Dad's gotta go cook some things. Okay, here we go. All right, let's get some tampons and pads for mom so that she can, <laughs> so she doesn't have to be so uncomfortable during her period. Okay, and then dad's gonna cook. He'll cook. We can't cook a certain salad. Oh, we don't have any lettuce. We're out of lettuce. Okay, shoot. Well, that's bummer. We need flour and lettuce. Okay, we need flour, lettuce. Oh, we also need flour to make a cake. Although we can make a chocolate cake, so that's good. We might do that. So we need flour. Um, definitely flour and what other things was I saying that I wanted? Flour and lettuce. Okay, let's order some delivery of groceries. All right, we're gonna get flour. Flour. Although we could get it cheaper when we go into the in this town. Oh, but he's hungry. All right, let's make him something. We'll cook. What can we make? A fruit salad. We made that last time. We do need to make a cake. Maybe a honey cake would be kind of cute. You make a honey cake for the kids and age them up. The baby needs talk too. Apparently, he'll he'll do that. Oh, actually, mom's home. Mom can do it. Yay! Okay, mom, come talk to the baby. Come talk to the baby. Dad's cooking a cake for Sage to age her up. And I guess they'll all just have, they'll all have cake and that'll be their food. Oh no, they're both upset. Why are they, why are they like this? Oh, she needs to go and put her, put like a, use a, Oh, she needs to open it up. Ugh, I hate that that's like a thing that you have to do. You have like open box and then you have to like unpack it. It's so weird. But regardless, now she can use them. Wait, we have a blue egg? <gasps> Whoa, what? That's crazy. Do we have any eggs left in here? How many eggs do we have in the? We have seven. Okay, we're good with eggs. Oh no! I should have watched you, Archer. You know, as long as you're having a good cake, I guess. Dang it. Ah! What's that sound? A wild Oprah dance! <gasps> Thank you so much to our Oprah, Emma! Gifting two gifted subs the to the community. Zone. Beth in a box, thank you so much to the resub. Happy one, half a year anniversary. And uh, Jamie Ely, thank you so much for the first trimester. Uh, Mumbles, is, uh, Mumbles is here. Thank you so much to the Twitch Prime sub. Queen Persephone plays. Thank you so much for gifting a sub to Laura Dory. Heck yes. And hey, thank you so much for a hundred bits. What's that sound? A wild Oprah dance. All right, you gotta make another honey cake, my dude. I guess we'll just have a ton of cake. Uh, I just need to watch, but I wish mom was taking better care of these kids. But she's just not feeling well. Oh my God, what a mess. All right, finish this cake so we can age up all the kids. Hurry, I don't want to do this anymore. <laughs> Big is grown up. Okay, 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 great, 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 great. Add birthday candles. I love this honey cake. It is absolutely adorable. I kind of want a honey cake myself now. This sounds really nice. Okay, okay. Can he clean this counter really quick? Thank you. All right, lavender, poor lavender. She's also hungry. She's gonna take a piece. Don't take a piece of the one with the candles though. Take a piece of here. Go get a leftovers of that cake. Okay, she's getting leftovers of that cake. Perfect. All right, let's go wake up our daughter Sage, who's also hungry. So we'll also be enjoying a piece of cake and help Sage blow out candles. All right, happy birthday Sage. 
Mom's eating a piece. Oh, but also hugging the dog. Very sweet. Okay, here we go. Sage's birthday. Mom's here watching as well. Her blow out the candles. Okay, mom's mom, mom's letting her pass to age up. Here Sage goes. She needs lots of room to jump. Oh my gosh, Sage! Okay, so for Sage, I'm thinking, and you guys can tell me if I'm wrong, but I feel like she's an animal enthusiast. She's like obsessed with animals and will seek their company often. Um, I just feel like that makes sense, right? What do you guys think? And then for her aspiration, I feel like she's a social, a little social being, but you guys can tell me. Yes, okay, you guys are like, yes, definitely animal enthusiast. And then what What should be her um, thing? Is she like a, I feel like she'd either be like a social or creative little kid. Creative makes sense because her mom and dad are both like musicians. Social or creativity? Okay, some of you are saying social. Creativity maybe? Creative, okay. Okay, several of you are saying creative now. Some of you saying social. Maybe we should do a poll. What do you guys think? Should we do a poll? Carmen Verhagen, thank you so much for the stretch. Although now most of you are saying creativity. And JMP uh, Little Children, thank you so much for the stretch. I'm gonna stretch here. Thank you so much to Cassie for the poll. Thank you, Cassie. Okay, most of you are saying creative. All right, perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, so she's creative and an animal enthusiast. I think this makes a lot of sense. What a bean, what a bean. Okay, Sage is so cute. I can't wait to CC her. All right, let's get her. Let's get her in there. E, 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 e. Flora. She's so sweet. She's really, she's really looking like mom. She looks a lot like mom. She's got strong mom energy and I love that for her. So Sage is a baby had wavy hair. So I feel like we should keep that um, as a kid. She should keep wavy hair. Um, I don't think it was as curly as mom's. It was this, she was wearing this as a kid. I don't really want her to wear it as a, oh, this one's really cute. Part of me wants to put her in this. She wore this as a kid. I really like this, that maybe her hair is like shorter, but we could also do something like this, which does also remind me of, of uh, mom or this one. Other things kind of, that's, that's a little too wavy. I don't think her hair had that much volume. Love the French braids. Okay, a lot of you are like braids. Okay, let's do the braids. I haven't really done those with many Sims anyway, so that'll be fun for us. Okay, where are the braids? Come back, braids. Oh, okay, I missed them like multiple times. Are they technically an updo? Yeah, they are. Okay, great, here are the braids. So sweet. Um, she has brown eyebrows, which is very odd um, when her hair is black, but whatever. Um, but I'm gonna give her kind of like floofy brows. I think that's, oh my gosh, she's so, she's a really cute Sim. Okay, uh, skin details. What does mom have? I kind of want her to have the same skin details as mom, possibly. Okay, she has that. What does dad have? Maybe she should have dad's because that way, Oh, dad doesn't have any. That's right. I remember that from last time now. We checked that last time. All right, so she, if she's gonna ask in details, she should have this like mom. But part of me wants to have her kind of look a little different. I thought this might be kind of nice. You know what? No, I kind of like this. She looks just like mom. Just like mom. I'm, oh, I'm obsessed. Look how sweet. I also never look through these. Maybe these ones. Although I think these, 
I like these ones at the corner of her eye. I think that's sweet. Kind of thicker in there. And then and then we'll do some some blush. Just like mom. Oh my gosh, just spitting image. She is like a just a mini me. <laughs> Wait, where did all her all her stuff go? What? Okay. Where did all her skin details go? That was really weird. Okay, that okay, it was just the eyelashes for some reason went away. Which I don't know why. Oh, I like that one actually. Eyelashes and her blush went away. Which is odd, but okay. Because I wanted to compare her to mom. She just looks just like mom. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh, Sage. Obviously she doesn't have makeup because she's a kid. But I kind of want her to have like big, big uh, brown eyes. Yeah. Oh my God. So cute. Okay, all right. And then Sage had like only green when she was a kid, or a little little girl. So I thought it might be fun to continue that uh, trend so that she wears a bunch of sage colors. This one's very sweet. I definitely see this for Sage going around the farm, helping mom. This is like her, uh, green, 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 green. Her like little farm, farm outfit kind of, kind of stuff. Where would be a good pair of shoes? No, I feel like some kind of boot or she could be barefoot. Actually, I think barefoot's cute. We'll have her be barefoot. She's a little barefoot queen. <laughs> All right, what other sweet little... This one's kind of sweet, but... Mm, this one's kind of nice. I like that one. This one's cute as well. <gasps> this one! That one's so sweet. A little helping mom out outfit. Um, I don't know, though. But maybe we'll put that as an option, but I don't... I don't I'm not obsessed. I'm not obsessed. To put color green in here. Um, thank you so much for purchasing some merch. Heck yeah. Oh, those sweaters are sweet. I like the sweaters. But this one is so, so sweet. I like that one too. <gasps> this one! That one's sweet. But this like, oh, that one. Okay, well. Oh, I like that. It kind of reminds me of when her mom was like, kind of a little less well off. It reminds me of that. Colors, let's go. Oh, not gray, green. I don't want to get like a pair of. Oh, this is so like that maybe that might match or mm. I don't hate that together but it's not perfect it's not quite what I had in mind we could do something like that Now I'm not feeling the shirt. I feel like maybe it's the shirt and if we had a different shirt. Or we could do just denim. Maybe we'll just do jeans in non-green, like a non-green jean, you know? Yeah, just like a normal denim. It's not super, like, it doesn't really match the rest of the family. It looks a little too modern for me. I think I'm gonna pass on this one, on this look. I'm gonna go some a different direction. It's too modern for me, I can't. I can't do it, it's too modern. Too modern, I can't. Uh, do, 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 do. To the, like the half, the little crop pants. So, yeah, these ones. These are so sweet. I think that matches a little better. Or what else could be with these? Obviously this. 
I think was made to match it. But that's also very, very modern. Oh, this sweater actually makes me happy. Let's do this in like maybe a little skirt. Or like, hmm. Why would you wear shorts with a sweater, Kelsey? I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> This is hard to keep the kids in the in the aesthetic. I will admit. It's a challenge. I do kind of like these two things together. I guess we could put like tights underneath. Mm. Shorts with boots though. Oh, boots would be would be nice. That could work. A boot. A boot could work. I like the I like this cozy boot. I'm just wondering if there's maybe a better color swatch. Yeah, maybe that. That kind of looks cute. I think this matches the vibe. I think this one's fine. <laughs> and then we'll do I like I liked this little this little outfit, this little ensemble. And then we'll do kind of a little, not those. There's these little boots. I thought that were nice. That would work. Yeah, nice. I think the dark brown is nice. Or maybe the light brown. Dark brown. Nice. I think this is sweet. Maybe add a hat to one of them. This one could probably have a hat. There's any good little hat. Oh, I do love these. <laughs> so cute. Ah! <laughs> I don't know if it really makes the outfit or not. It probably doesn't. But it is kind of cute. I think no to the hat. I think no to the hat. And then maybe we want one like, one like cute outfit. Oh, that's cute. Well, maybe this one. Yeah, I like that a lot. This one's really sweet. Okay. Nice. Perfect, perfect. All right. Formal wear in the green. She is like kind of a princess actually. So maybe she should wear something like really fancy since she's a princess. I like this on her actually. I think that's pretty, pretty cute. And then maybe we'll do her hair a little different when she's in princess mode, you know? When she has to go to like the family, family events and be princess. Be, oh, that one's kind of sweet, but I don't like the bow. That one's also sweet, but I don't like the bow. That one's okay, but it's too much hair. No. No, not the right style of hair. That's almost there. That's almost there. I guess maybe the little tiara one, sweet. She could just be very princess. Very princess. I wonder if this dress, we should change its color to go with the silver more of the, of the tiara. Yeah, and then we'll give her like little gloves or something. Oh, there's no formal gloves for children. Weird. There she goes, though. Pretty. 
This is like her formal princess look. And then we'll give her like a formal look where it's like she's she's hanging out with family but being formal. Maybe this or this one. I like this one. I think that one's nice. And then hair, we'll change the hair back to maybe like a like a soft little down. Oh, I don't like the that at the back though. Um This one's nice. Yeah. And then shoes, we'll change the shoes. From green to like a little white. There you go. Princess to more casual at home with family. All right, fitness. Oh, I like this one, but I think this one's kind of sweeter. Or this one actually is funny too, but I like this one. And then we'll give her kind of like some little, actually she barefoot. She running around like this when she's when she's being fit. Sleepwear, we gotta have a sweet little little sleepwear moment. Maybe <laughs> none of those, none of those. What about here? None of these are really grabbing me. If we took off sleep, wasn't there like a dress? about that? I was like, I bet there's like a dress that would give me sleep. Dress feels, maybe not. Maybe I'm making this up. Hmm. Mm. It's, it's cute, but that's not quite what I had in mind. No, not that either. Okay, maybe not, maybe not. Maybe we should put sleep back on. Mm. This one's cute. We'll do this. We'll do this. That's cute. Party! Oh, her ears are not pierced yet. That is a lie. A lie! Okay, party look. I feel like if she's at home at a party, she would wear something like chill. I don't think she'd dress up too much. Like something like that would probably work. Or I like this one or this one. Maybe, maybe this one would be nice. I like this version of it actually better. Let's do this. No shoes. <laughs> Swimwear. Mm. Hmm. Not in love with any of them. I like this little blue one though on her, I suppose. It's kind of sweet. Let's do that. And then hot weather. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Girl, you don't need that much acc accoutrement. Um, hot weather. Oh, this, this is kind of cute if the color swatches weren't so weird. I did like this one, but I don't feel like that screams hot weather to me, nor, nor does that. If it's hot outside. Maybe that? Ah, so hard. That one's kind of cute. So hard to find not modern swimsuits for kids. I know. That's how I feel. I kind of like this little brown dress for some reason. I think it's kind of kind of fun. Let's do that for hot weather. <laughs> Even though it's not green, I think that matches the aesthetic. And then cold weather, cold weather, cold weather. Is there like a, a deep, yeah, maybe that would work for her. I think I like this like deep green and then we'll do a big old boot. 
Big green boots. Color. Green. I really take uh, color themes seriously ever since the Not So Berry Challenge. Um, I don't know why. I, just, I really do. I really take it very seriously. The, ma the gold buckles match, so I'm going to go with this. Yay! Gia, thank you so much for nine whole months! You are now a danger baby! Alina, thank you so much for four months. Uh, Gnarly Carly, thank you so much for four months. Maya Lamun, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Bex Wyvern, thank you so much for five whole months as well. Hat, good idea. We should do a hat for uh, cold weather. I agree with you. Maybe we'll do the little hat that I was like thinking about but didn't do, this one. Well, that's maybe the little green one. That's kind of sweet. <laughs> Although I don't know if it'll be as warm. Kind of like that style of it better anyway. This one matches the scarf. I kind of want a knit hat though. Oh, I like this one because it matches the dress. That one's nice. I wish you could do like something like this. It's funny. No, I want this this one. I think it matches the dress and it looks nice on her. Perfect. What a sweetheart. Oh, Sage. Yes, so cute. Alina. A wild Oprah beard. Alina Ka Ka Denise, thank you so much for gifting not one but two gifted subs for a total of four gifted subs total to the channel heck yes oh my gosh we got a treat for chewy hit record yo thanks for your patience he didn't even turn around he's like i'll i'll let you bring it to me uh katie bird you are doing amazing sweetie thank you so much for tuning in for the stream and tiva weave thank you so much for the stream okay Billy Bob, Bob, thank you so much for the tier one sub. Are you going to do the additional brown generation for the not so berry? I have not heard about this additional brown generation, so probably not, but I don't know. I've never even heard of that. Okay, so. Sage is now a child, which means we need to change her bed in her bedroom. I don't know if we need to change any of the other things in her bedroom. I guess we'll decide in time. Um, but we need like a child, a child bed. We'll swap it for color green. See what we got. Option wise for a kid bed in green. We could do like a lofted one. I don't think we need to do something like that though. Oh, none of the beds look good in green. All right. Let's just look at the normal beds, the kids' options. I guess we could just give her an adult bed. They are technically like the same size. All right, let's give her, we could give her like this bed, which actually kind of matches. Okay, kind of matches. There's a lot of pattern. This one also would look good. Ooh, it's a bunk. <gasps> this one, I like this one because of the, I like the um, the frame, but I don't like any of the colors. This one's fine. No, I don't like the bedspread. This one's nice. I think it would match. Maybe this one. I need to see her in it. Let's come in this room here, sweetie. I need to see the lights on so I can see what the bed looks like. All right, great, thank you. Actually, that matches. That matches the curtains pretty well. Let me see. Let me just see what other options we have. We'll put this in the inventory for now. Okay, green. Green beds. Okay, now I can really, really take a look here. I like this bed spread is sweet. It looks very homey having a bed spread like that. And all these are not single beds. So we've run to the top of the list here. 
This one was also one I considered. Mm, no. I think... I think it just comes down to, like, little... I just think that's too much pattern. I think this works the best. I think there's too much pattern because the wallpaper and the rug and the bed thing was just too much. So I think this green is great. All right, and now you're hungry, so go get some, some cake. Go take a piece of cake. And Ophelia is upset, but luckily it's time to age these babies up. Come on and age them up. Mom and dad are walking upstairs to age up babies at the same time. Oh, Oliver got a gift from Rose. And Oliver is either wild, angelic, or inquisitive. What do you guys think? Wild, angelic, or inquisitive for Oliver? I'll let you guys tell me in the chat. The dark green one was great. Okay, I'm glad that you guys like it too. Dominique says wild. Sumiko says angelic. Two of you say wild. One says inquisitive. Okay, it seems like it's between wild and inquisitive. Uh, Cynthia, thank you so much for our 200 bits. Thanks for tossing a coin to this Twitcher. And also for four months. Okay, most of you are saying wild. I'm seeing. I'm seeing most. Oh, but now in the poll, most of you are saying inquisitive. That would be kind of cute, like a like a quiet smart boy. I could love. I could love on that. Little quiet smart boy. Mm. <laughs> and I do like the idea of Olivia or Ophelia being independent. That makes me happy too. The music's a little loud today. It might be a little extra loud. I, I did kind of bump it up. Here, I'll, I'll turn it down for you. Okay, most of you are saying inquisitive. I feel that. Let's do it. A little inquisitive bean. All right, mom, come age up the second baby. Second baby gets aged up. A bit of Ophelia. So a lot of you are saying independent. I think that'd be really sweet. I like that, that little like difference between the two. Oh, look at them. So sweet. Oh, and they're just gonna do the first steps through through the bassinets. Of course they did. Sure. What a choice. What a choice. All right, let's look for kids' beds. Oh, not in our not in our inventory here. We need some kids, some Todd beds. Preferably in a brown. What did we use those? I think we used like this. I mean, that's sweet. Oh, I like the dark brown wood though for the Todd beds. So we could do like two of these, but then like we could change one of them having like a different bed. Oh, but the, ah, I want their like frames to match is the problem. Oh, maybe the blue. I guess that works. Yeah, I think that works. Although this is like a chaos, a chaotic room with the two beds. They don't really fit with each other. Um, feels like a little cramped in here with that. So let me. All right, let's move some stuff around here. Um, do we, do we take out this? I wonder if this is really necessary. I feel like we could maybe take this out, this little dresser. Even though I like the dresser, I feel like we don't need a, a full dresser and we could just do like a little uh, like toy box or something, you know? Um, we do something like short like that more like their height. Doesn't feel like it's taking up as much room, even though it kind of is still. Uh, let's do a little toy box, maybe. Although none of the toy box probably match. Although this one's like an animal. That one's kind of cute. Let's make it small, put it in the corner. That's sweet. And then we'll put the toys back on the ground over here so they can range them. Uh, we don't have to have this there, but I like it. So I guess we'll keep that. <laughs> Put the toys over here and the little horse. Horse is very important. Okay. Yeah. 
looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. You know? It is a little trimmed. I do wonder. One of you said to maybe put the beds where the the um dresser was. I'm going to try that. Let's see what it looks like. All right, let's put that in our inventory. All right, let's move these here and see what they... My one problem is I wonder if they can like put the kids in, you know? I feel like maybe we'd have to put them in like different spots. Like if this was up against the wall here. And then maybe this one's here. Or we could put them on either side of the room. Like this. We could sell the mirror. Put like a plant here. I don't know if we need the rocking chair either, to be honest. And we'll put this here for them to play with. And then put their toys down. Maybe this makes more sense. Um, potty upstairs. Oh, definitely. That would be a good idea for sure to put a potty upstairs. We'll put this in this corner here. And we'll put like these guys. I do miss the rocking chair, but I just think with twins, it's going to be hard to fit everything in general. So probably not a rocking chair room anymore. Maybe someday. We'll still have the one downstairs. Okay, and then we need... What was the other thing I was going to put out? Oh, yeah, you said potty. All right, we'll put a little potty chair. There is, like, a little brown one, which is kind of cute. But there's, like, the little white one. Or a little black one. I like the brown one, honestly. Because what else am I going to use it? So we'll do a little potty chairs. We can even have two in case you want both toddlers to potty at the same time. And that way, I feel like this looks a little more, um, like, I don't know, organized, I guess. Like, a little more, like, open space. Uh, so, yeah. So, there we go. The Todds can be up here in their room. And now we need to give them makeovers because they, they be, they be messy looking right now. <laughs> Potty chair on both floors. We do have a potty chair on both floors already. If you remember, I did not delete the one downstairs yet, so we're gonna keep it. All right, so here's Oliver. Oh my gosh, Oliver. What is this accessory, accessory hound? Okay, so Oliver, I feel like Oliver and Ophelia are a little bit closer skin tone to their father, but not really. Oh my gosh, look at Ophelia. Um. Look at, I just not, I do not like whatever they have with this boo-boo blush going on. It's just way too much. What is the blush? Where is the blush? Is it on in makeup? What is happening? Oh yeah, so they put makeup on my baby. What the heck? Why? Why would you do that? Why would you put makeup on my baby? I don't know. But here they both are. I do like the idea of having uh, Oliver's hair be long, but I don't like that hair. Um, so yeah, that's a no for me. All right. So here we'll go with Oliver first. Oliver, I think we'll have the same as mom, the same like CC skin and maybe like, can we get like kind of low, lower key lashes for Oliver. Do these cute. All right. And then eyebrows, I think they're fine. I, I'm not like a huge fan. Maybe we'll do more like that. I think that's better. And then hair, I like a longer hair, but I would love a, a, one of them to have like curly hair like mom. So I kind of like Oliver having this hair. This kind of makes me happy. Uh, we could also have like a medium length, like a longer hair for Oliver, but I don't know. I love this hair. Oliver is mini Archer. He does kind of look like Archer. I love this hair on him. I can't, I can't not give him this hair. This is his hair. I can't, I can't change it now. It's too late. It's too late. 
And look, he could have like a little, oh my God. Oh my gosh. How cute is this kid? This kid is so cute. Oh, look at the little pants. Look at the little pants. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh no, Oliver's gonna be out here breaking hearts. No, no shoes. He looks like a little hobbit. <laughs> yeah, his his eyes are very big. I think that might be one of the reasons why he's so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So cute. Oh my gosh. He'll probably have the same. I realize I didn't put the eyes on every outfit for, for um, Sage, but here we are. Oh my gosh, look at him, look at him. I also kind of want to give him a second outfit where he can have like a little, like a little button down yeah. moment. <laughs> yeah. Or maybe like a little sweater, a little sweater bow. Oh, the sweater is so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh, stop it, he's so sweet looking. Look at it. <laughs> so sweet. I love him. Apparently, I'm just dressing him all in black, similar to his dad. I'm a lazy girl. What can I say? You know? I can't help it. I can't help it. Where's the... Oh, my gosh. Look at this little look. Oh my goodness, look at this little guy and this look. I think I like this dark brown with the green shirt the best. Oh my god. <laughs> it's so cute. Okay, and then this one obviously would be very sweet, but I think maybe we'll put this one on his sister. I do like this one though, that's kind of cute. Oh, they could have matching ones. Okay, that's fine. Good, okay. Formal wear, again, I think he's like a little prince, so he should have something nice. I love that look. Sleepy time, you gotta do these little foxy pajamas. That's adorable. Party wear. I honestly like what he's got going on. Let's just change up the color. We could do black. Black is a little boring. I think he can do better, maybe. I think the dark blue looks nice. And then let's change the pants. We'll do, I mean, these are kind of fun. Or, not really matching though. I do love these pants and I kind of want to wear them multiple times. I don't know if they go with this outfit. They're more like corduroy. We just do a black. A little boring, Kelsey, but it's a choice, you know? And if it's party, maybe the, his parents will force him into some shoes. I like that he's just not wearing shoes 90% of the time. And I think that's adorable for him. Swimwear. He's a little, he's a baby. He doesn't need swimwear. Look at him. He looks like that when he swims. Normal. Hot weather wear. Honestly, kind of same. He doesn't really need. Although this is sweet. This is really cute. You know, maybe we will. We will give a little hot weather wear. Or this one in the blue. He wears this for hot weather. I actually kind of like that better. Maybe for hot weather, they have a matching outfit. And then cold weather. I just think this is so darling. Look how sweet that is with the plaid. The plaid. Oh my gosh. So sweet. We'll do these boots in like a green to match. Yep. <laughs> so sweet. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oliver is everything. Oliver is such a sweetie. Such a sweetie. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is Oliver. All right, let's get to Ophelia. Yeah. Ophelia, um, is the hair, the hair is like, the short hair is okay, but it's not my favorite, so I'm gonna swap it. She could have short hair maybe later in life, but not right now, in my opinion. Um, so skin details. Ophelia, I feel like maybe we should give her something else. Maybe we should give her like a, Oh, freckles would be cute. Although no, neither of her parents have freckles, huh? He does not, certainly. And she does not at all. But 
I just feel like one of them with freckles could be kind of sweet. <laughs> Ophelia. Ophelia has freckles. It's canon. I can't help it. I can't help it. Ophelia has some freckles on her face. Uh, please try purple eyes. Okay, we'll do purple eyes for Ophelia. Good idea. Good idea. We'll do purple eyes. Didn't he have a... Did he have the dark purple? What? Which eyes do you have, sir? Hmm. Which eyes do you have? I just need to know. Oh, okay. They're those eyes. Let me double check. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're the, the one after that. Okay. And which color? What purple is it? Is it this? It's this one. Okay, the darker. Okay. Okay, Ophelia got dad's eyes. So that's, that's cute. I like that. She got the emotions in this purple. <gasps> oh, wow. She inherited from her grandmother's. Oh, that's cute. I like it. I like it. The, the freckles come from the grandmother. I like that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, Ophelia. Look at these, these cursed, the cursed hairs. We, we don't talk about the cursed hairs. All right. Those are all my hairs for future babies. Um, Ophelia, what hair should you, wait. Okay, yes, they're toddlers. I was like, are they all the same age? No, these are toddlers. She just somehow does not look like a toddler to me and I don't know why that is, but it is it is the facts that Ophelia does not, lo does not look like a toddler. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, she could have like a little updo or a medium length hair. I do like this hair. This hair is really sweet. <laughs> Somehow she has like a very, very big forehead with this hair though. I don't know if it's just like her face is really low. I can't really figure yeah. it out. So I don't think I, I don't think this haircut is, is for Ophelia. Oh, may, maybe Ophelia gets bangs. You know, not that there's anything wrong with a higher forehead. It just looks like, I don't know. It just looks a little off. Maybe she would suit bangs. Oh, she kind of does. Maybe we should give her some bangs. That'd be cute. But it's weird because these hairs don't look as like weird, odd on her. You know what I mean? She still has like a, a forehead, but it's not as like, I don't know. For some reason that one hair looked a little unflattering. This is sweet. We could give her this little her head is super long. Maybe that's what it is. I'm like, it's so, what an interesting, interesting trait. I think, I think she'll be bang queen. She'll just be queen with bang. And we, and we love that. <laughs> this one's really sweet. We could do this one. Or this one. Oh, I just wish I could change that, the color of the little bow thing. Cause it doesn't quite match as much. I like that one, or I like, oh, this one's sweet too. The little braid, that one's cute. Or this one, mm, pigtails. I think I'm gonna go with this one for now. I think this one's really sweet. We'll maybe do pigtails on another one. Okay, Ophelia. I feel like purple could be Ophelia's color, maybe. Just because she has the purple eyes and it's just, I don't know, for me, it just feels right to give her a little bit of purple. Although I don't know how much, maybe we'll just look through what is in the wheelhouse for, for uh, this kind of era. <gasps> this is sweet though. Look at her, look at her. She's so sweet. She's Miss Independent too. So I think that's kind of fun that she's like a little miss, miss independent Ophelia. Purple and like green, yeah. I could see that. This one's got little green and purple on it. Definitely made her eyes pop. I could definitely see Ophelia being a little more like dolled up. <laughs> like look how sweet she looks at all these outfits. I'm just like, oh, she's a doll now. Barney colors. Hey man, Barney colors be cute, you know? Oh, I like this one on her too. I think that 
That should probably be your hot weather look, even though I said that they match. Maybe they will sometimes. All right, so that one's, that one's sweet. Yeah. We'll just give her like these little floral, little floofy floral outfits because I can't, I can't not give her them. They're so cute. Oh, maybe this is for like a cooler day. Sure, we'll little boots or something with it. Or maybe these little boots. Do they come in like a purple or like a white? No. Oh, these are kind of nice. Or the, I like the little flowers on it. That's sweet. I like that for some reason. Although, maybe I don't. Maybe I don't. I liked it and then I stopped liking it very quickly. It was a it was a very, very sudden change of heart. These remind me of bees and there's bees on her outfit. So, it's fine. Whatever. All right. Oh, look at this one. I don't remember putting this on the, our other our other sim. I don't think it comes. No, it did come in green. Look at it. It was in green. I don't remember putting this on Sage. Look how sweet this is. That's so sweet. Okay. And then, oh, look at this one too. Oh, we did put this one on Sage. I do remember this one was on Sage. That one was. <gasps> this one wasn't though. Look how many cute little like animal things there are for toddlers. Wow. Cottage Living really went there. Really said that. Okay. Look at all these cute little. <laughs> I like weirdly do not like this outfit on her for some reason. So I'm going to skip that one. I didn't like it. I didn't enjoy. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this one's sweet. With this one. Or this one, this one's so cute. Oh, look. That might be more of the formal wear though. We might just do only four outfits for this first one. Okay, formal wear. Why, why do they put like makeup on my baby? I don't understand. Don't put makeup on my baby. All right, we're gonna put this on for formal. For one formal outfit. I think that's sweet. That's like the fo the home one. And then the princess one is like, is more like a, uh, maybe this? Yeah. Oh my gosh. She's a hundred percent dad's, dad's, dad's girl. Like this is a dad girl, a daddy girl for sure. Look at a little princess. <laughs> oh my goodness. So cute. Little, little shoes. Why do they keep putting, like, why? Stop putting makeup on my children, Sims. She has matching pajamas to her brother. I don't make the rules. I'm just a slave to them. I'll linger. Thank you so much for seven months. Oh, I do need to do the purple eyes on, on the rest of it. Okay, good idea. Good idea. All right. Do not let me forget. Purple emotion eyes. I didn't do one for the other ones because I became a lazy girl, but we will do it for her since her eyes a literal different color. It is dad's eyes. We got dad's eyes in here at some point. Why do they keep putting makeup on my baby? I don't understand. I've never had this issue before with Sims where they just put makeup on all of the children. And so consistently too, it's su it's a surprise. Okay, come back, come. There we go, purple eyes and... There we go. Perfect. All right. So we've got our 
two outfits here. All right, pajamas. We could do a different color. Is there one that's still foxes, but a different color? <gasps> yes, okay, boom. There he goes. He's got the blue ones. She's got these like brown ones. I think that's sweet. Party wear. Why did, why did they, why did they, I didn't, I must have not noticed. Oh no, don't keep that back on there. I must have not noticed that they had done it that time. All right, party wear, party wear. Maybe this is the time for this outfit. It's just such a little, a little like princessy little girl that I feel like her party would be something like this, even though we already wore it once. Oh, we could do the purple version, I suppose. Although I like the, the like patterns. Maybe we'll do this blue. I mean, her mom did dress herself in a lot of blue, so it would make sense that mom also put a lot of blue on her daughter. Party wear, swimwear. She's a little girl, she gonna swim like that. <laughs> Hot weather, okay. I will be doing two because I can't not do this little, this little number. It's too, it's too cute. It simply is too cute. So that is one hot weather and then we'll do the one that matches her brother. This one. Cute! Although it does not, it doesn't suit her as much, but it's fine. Cold weather. Okay. This one in purple, of course, with purple boots or, or black boots or brown boots. I love this pattern, but it does not match anything. Um, hmm, I guess maybe brown, black will make the most sense or brown. Oh, I like this like textured one. Yeah. <laughs> I like the textured one. That one's cute. All right. Perfect. Ophelia, you nailed it. There she is. Ophelia Thorn. Look how cute. Oh my gosh, Ophelia and Oliver. Look at Oliver. I know Ophelia. Should Oliver have the purple eyes too? Just a question. Um, Jessica, thank you so much for redeeming a treat for Chewy. We also got a bean requirement up in here. Okay, lots to do. So Denise would like a stretch. No, just Ophelia. Okay, excellent, excellent. All right, uh, we got a dab for Flame Fox. Uh, and then we got a stretch for Ms. HQ Kilana. Thank you so much for the stretch. Do like a nice little lower back twist. Nice and gentle. Uh, and then we got a treat for Chewy from Jessica Ottman. Thank you, Jessica. And a non-treat for me from Amelia. Amelia, thanks for uh, redeeming a bean. It's bean time, baby. It's bean time. I'm not ready for this. Uh, okay. Here we go. <laughs> I saw it and then I went, no, not today. I do not have water ready, so I might have to run out. Come on, give me a bean. Okay, I have not, I did not have this bean in a while, so we'll do this bean. I'm choosing the bean, but it's not a non-gross bean. It, it could be a very gross bean. All right, so here's the bean. It is a nice lemon lime color. It is either juicy pear or booger. I don't think I've had this one in a minute, so we're gonna try with this one. Am I gonna bet all my dollars? Yes, I love that for you. <laughs> okay, so guys, is it juicy pear or booger? Let me know. I hope it's pear. I hope it's pear. Ooh, uh, I don't know what the Jelly Belly overlords think that 
booger tastes like too, so I'm a little worried. I feel like boogers normally don't really taste much like anything, but I feel like they're gonna make it gross, you know? Ugh, juicy booger. Oh, gross, Lilith. <laughs> Hate to see it. Let's go team pear, Leah. Leah, let's go. Look at these beans. Look at them, look at the sweeties. Okay, this one. Oh, it doesn't really matter which one's in which. Look at Oliver. Look at him. <laughs> He's gonna break my heart. Oh my God. I think I think all of these kids are gonna be too beautiful. And look at Sage. I feel like Sage is gonna be the perfect older sister. I, ugh, I can't. Look at Archer. He's like, let's make more kids. <laughs> let's make more kids. Okay, you guys have voted. I've never guessed the wrong bean. Apple, I hope today is the day for you. Sorry, I'm not sorry. All right, are we ready? And the, I have exactly $400 left, oh no. And the winner is. Juicy pear. <laughs> Sorry, Cassie. <laughs> Let's go. It's a good bean day. You know how there was like the uh, bones or no bones? I feel like that's what it is. Well, enjoy the points, chat. <laughs> My streak is gone. Yeah. Yeah, I just made 4.6K. Whoa. Boo, it's rigged. It was not rigged. It's still random. Can they just have a huge family? I mean, they I guess they could. We could have like one more kid, I guess. Ah, it's just, it'll be so many sims. One, two, three, four, five, six. We could technically have two more, two more kids. Technically, oh my God, but that would be a lot. What do you guys think? Should we have one or two more kids or should we just leave it here? That would be a lot. I'd have to like expand the house again. <laughs> oh, thank you guys so much for watching the ads. I appreciate it. I know it's not always fun, but it's a good way to help support me. <laughs> oh my God, look at these cuties. I'm just, uh, one more, leave it up to fate. We could leave it up to fate. We could just have a woohoo and see what happens. You know, look at him chatting with his daughter. He loves <laughs> life soon. right now. It's 1 a.m. though. So let's make everybody go to bed because it's it's time for bed, kids. Okay, it's time for bed. Kids got to go to bed. Mom, why don't you uh, put Ophelia to bed? And why don't you go to sleep? He wants to go. He wants to go play outside. He can't get up there. All right. Well, he's feeling very flirty and he fell asleep in there. All right. Mom, mom, can you put, put Ophelia to bed and then put Oliver to bed? Mom's putting the kids to bed. It's 1 a.m. So it's, it's time for them to go all go to bed. This is bedtime for, for the kids. I don't care what your needs are. It's bedtime. We're going to try to do a good bedtime. I can't stand the smell. What is the smell that you're spilling that you can't stand? Yeah, so He's like, I'm having a bubble bath. I can't smell anything anymore. Oh my gosh, look at Oliver just in his sister's room. Like, hey, hey, Sage, I want to play with you. And she's like, no, Oliver, it's bedtime. It's bedtime. Oh God, it's the screen. I'll realize it sooner or later. Shh. I can't see, stand the nothing. You know, I like to, I like to tease you guys, make you guys, uh, you know, wish you were there. There we go. Oh, his little outfit matches his bed. And I think hers matches her bed too. That's really cute. Okay, good night, little Oliver. Meanwhile, meanwhile, Archer's having a slice of cake. Good. Look how detailed this is, he says, probably about his own cake. Proud of you. Proud of you, sweetie, that you uh took care of that cake. He's going to go up and ask his wife for a... Uh, for a little, for a little boohoo. She's waiting in the kids' room. She's exhausted. 
What are you doing? Spama. Flume. He's just chatting with Spama her. Chama. Very playful. Oh my gosh. Just, I've literally asked you to, well, now he doesn't want to woohoo. Okay, we'll woohoo tomorrow. Why don't we just go to sleep? <laughs> She's too tired. <laughs> And he is now as playful and he's not as flirty as he was, so. They're gonna go to bed. We might woohoo tomorrow, okay? I wanna handle the, the family as they are now for like at least a couple days before we have to be pregnant again. A word ban. Like. Oh, purple like fire. You're brutal. Alright. Set a timer for five minutes. I'm gonna try my darndest. Sage is awake and getting cake because, of course, I have, uh, oh, slamming the door. She's tense. She's, I, am I, I am a fool, she says. They are probably laughing at me. I can understand why they would, though. And she is also embarrassed for some reason. I do not know why. She, she has gross teeth, though. Maybe she needs to. Oh, she's maybe annoyed from being an older sister. I don't know. Why don't we brush our teeth after our cake, though? I think dad needs to make something healthier. Hi, back to the UK! And hi to South Africa. How cool! Bailey, thank you so much for six whole months! We're brushing our teeth and eating cake. What a, what a mood. No, 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 no. It is bedtime. It is still 6 a.m. Go back to bed. All right. Sleep a little bit longer, please. Please sleep a little longer. All my Sims. Oh, as usual, this is broken. Our mail has been delivered. That's nice. Oh, Oliver is up and he is hungry and mad. Mad and hungry about to go wake mom up. I'll let him wake mom up. That's funny. He's like, mom. Oh, shoot. I said it. All right. I was really close. I was close. I, I had, I, I lasted two minutes. Impressive for me, I suppose. All right. All right. I tried. I did pretty good. It's just common vernacular for for Americans to say like, as opposed to said. And I had myself there. One of my main sibs is some snob and constantly disappointed by my decor. Any advice to make her not so disappointed? I think that sims that are snobs just like uh, more expensive decor. So if you swapped it for something more expensive, they'd probably be less inclined. You can also probably change their decor preferences uh, and make their decor preferences whatever you like to. Okay, so here is the next one. It is a beautiful white bean, and it is either oh no, spoiled milk or coconut. Will my luck last? Let's find, let's find out. All of you guys vote. Bet your points if you dare. We're waking up, mom here. Dad, 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 dad. Mom, why don't you take him down? Should listen to Oliver's question. Just just go give food to Oliver down here. We're gonna give him a ham and cheese sandwich. That sounds kind of nice. Aww. And how's Sage? Sage is taking care of her needs. Like the little sweetie she is. She's gonna do her homework for school tomorrow. She's got I think she's gonna go do it in the library. Nope, she's doing it in her in her little sibling's room. Oh, Ophelia's also hungry. I think we need two high chairs because I do not think one is gonna be enough for the twins. There we go, a little second high chair moment. All right, use those channel points. Did anyone vote? Poll was broken. Nobody won. Nobody could, nobody could vote. Should we try the poll again? Let's try it again. All right, dad's up. Why don't you give food to Ophelia and give her also a ham and cheese sandwich, even though I know you need to pee. 
We gotta take care of these kids. Make sure they're not dying on us, you know. We do not want to join Party House. Okay, there we go. It's working now. Good. Thank you so much, mods. Gonna feed the chillins. Feed the bubbies. We only have enough for a family of one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. So we only have enough chairs for like the right amount of Sims at the moment. There we go. Sage, why, why don't you say hi to our our family friend here, Agatha? She's practically your grandmother. Ah, it's over. Okay, you guys ready? You all voted? Okay, here we go. Okay. Here we go. Coconut gang, be strong. Coconut gang, be strong. Okay, here we go. Countdown. Three, two, one. Brrr. And it's... It's coconut. <laughs> two for two, baby. Let's go. That was coconut. Unequivocally. That was a good bean. I don't know if I've ever had a coconut bean. <laughs> Ash K, thank you so much for giving a treat to Chewy. Purple like fire, thank you so much for your word band challenge. That was a good one, that was a good one. We'll give a treat to Chewy. This one's from Ash K. Oh, it's so gentle, so gentle. And Evie Black, thank you so much for the stretch. Dang, Stonewall Mommy would also get, like to give a treat to Chew. Oh, Chew, you're getting all the yummies. Here you go, sweetheart. Oh, I dropped it. Get it? Good boy, good boy. Say thank you, Stonewall Mommy, for giving. Coco, not this time, baby. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. That's so funny. Oh my gosh. Wow. Most people said spoiled milk. Uh-uh. Wow. Me and Chewie getting treats today. Dang, impressive. All right. Gotta let the baby out now. Actually, you know what? They can sit there for a minute while mom eats. Ooh, we got like four simoleons from our little pixies. Sage is chatting with uh, Agatha. How sweet is that? And dad's out fixing some, fixing some stuff here. It's another day on the farm. I'm, I'm wondering if Sage can help on the farm. Mom, why don't you help your daughter with homework? And dad, once you're done, you can let the kids out. Actually, he needs to go to the bathroom. Once you're done, you can go to the bathroom. And then you can let the kids out. <laughs> but they're they're fine. They're just happy. They're chirping away. Lavender's helping our daughter with homework. She's feeling very playful as usual. Just chaotic out here. Gotta fix the. Hey, oh, he just likes handiness. All right, yeah, that works. That that's funny for him. He doesn't like handiness. Maybe maybe we'll have lavender fix these in the future. <laughs> he hates it so much. That's pretty funny. Oh, lavender's already done, so I guess she will be the one to let the the kids out. Lavender, why don't you let this one out too? Oh, wait, 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 wait! Pick her up! Pick her up! Go pick up your crying child, Lavender. Lavender, go pick up your crying child. There we go. What is he doing? He's just like, what's that? Oh my gosh, there's too many kids. I can't even keep track of all of these kids. This is too many kids. Maybe we'll have more kids, but not this second, okay? These toddlers need to age up. Ah! No, 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 shut it down. Shut it down, shut it down, shut it down, shut it down. Maybe don't send her home, but shut this down. Stop flirting with my husband, woman. Stop it. Oh my gosh. Pink Wolf Lady, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime sub. Oh my gosh. Stop flirting with my husband. Stop it. 
Shima bar stool. He collected everything from the mailbox. What did he get? What did we get? I think we got a couple things for the kids. Oh, sweet. We did. All right. We'll put those in here. Yep. It's about right. Okay. I think we need to go into town today to sell some of this stuff. Since, uh, yeah, seems, seems like we got a lot of things to sell. We haven't been in town in a couple days. I think this should be, oh, it's slightly dirty. It's, ah, whatever. We're going to collect eggs and we're just going to scatter some feeds. We can't put that egg in there. Incubating coop. Yeah. The, the coop's full though, right? Yeah, it is. That's okay. He's chatting with the kids. Oliver's sad because he wants fun. But he's playing with the toy, so he's okay. Thank you so much for the bits, Denise! I appreciate you. My new matriarch for the 100 Baby Challenge lives in a house that makes twins more possible. And she had three sets of twins. Wouldn't do it. I refused in my, in my challenge. I like stopped having twins. Well, no, I did have a lot of twins. Actually, I did have a lot of twins, but I, I tried to space them out. Owlinger, thank you so much for gifting us up. A wild Oprah appeared. Whoop, whoop. Thank you so much, Owlinger, for your 34th gifted sub to the community. That's super generous of you. Okay. It says, I was thinking about one of my favorite toys and I can't find it. I'm starting to miss it and I feel sad. Oh, keep looking for it. You got this, girl. You got this. You got this, Sage. Maybe, maybe you can't find it because your little siblings are, are uh, using it. Sage, why don't you help mom out in the garden today? I bet you could help. Why, can you, can you, oh my gosh, she can. Oh my gosh, Sage, we're putting you to work. Sage is off to work. She loves animals too, so she, I feel like she's gonna love this. She's like, don't worry, mom, I'm gonna clean, I'm gonna clean Snowflake for you. What else does Snowflake need? Oh, now Snowflake's clean. I don't understand, but it's fine. Snowflake, uh, why don't you give Snowflake a little tree? Oh, you don't have any treats. All right. Socialize. Oh, she's embarrassed. Why are you embarrassed, sweetie? Oh, she walked in on something weird. What was that? She can clean the set shed too. This is incredible. And she's gonna love it. Oh, I love this for all of us. I feel like climbing a mountain. Good for you, Lavender. Oh my gosh, he's all he's all filled up. He needs some fun. This is so chaotic, keeping track of everybody. Tim Morse, thank you so much for 300 bits. I'm doing my not so very Thanks for the inspiration, Kelsey. And writing up basically a synopsis of the generation is kind of like a brief story time thing. Does anyone know any forums where other people have posted their not so very generation stories? Oh, I don't know of anyone. Uh, but I bet, I bet like Tumblr or something might have something like that. Although I don't know if, how many people use Tumblr anymore. I don't um, necessarily. But I don't know. I'm sure someone in this chat might know. He's he's going to play. Why don't you play piano for fun? Go we'll play some piano. Lavender is going to. Lavender, why don't you play guitar? How's Oliver? He needs attention. Oh, maybe dad, you know what? Instead of playing piano, why don't you like hug and play with the, play with the kid. Go play, go play and read to your kid. That'll be cute. Do you have a toddler book in your inventory? You don't. Mom, I think did at one point. I don't know, whatever. You're gonna play with your kids. Mom, I think you might wanna just go to the store. How's Sage? Sage is clean, oh no. Look at Ophelia was left without supervision and decided to make a mess. Oh my gosh, the chaos. The chaos. Why don't you harvest everything really quick? Oh my gosh, it's so hard to keep track of everybody. I cannot, I cannot. This is hard, this is hard. Patchy, stop talking with my family, okay? Are you reading to your child or not? Go get a go get a book. Oh my gosh. Here's a children's book. Read that to your child, okay? Read to children. Read a 
read to all of them. Read to both of them, okay? Go read to both of the kids. How's Sage? She's, oh no. She's stinky and everything is falling apart. This is bad. This is so bad. <laughs> oh no, okay. Okay, well, let's, let's go, let's go. All right, we're gonna travel by ourselves. Just mom's gonna go. Dad's gonna stay with the kids. <laughs> I can't. Let's get a new house pet. Willow needs a friend. Nope. Did you just not see all of the stress I just had? Do you think taking care of another animal is gonna help? Absolutely not. Willow has enough animal friends. Also, Willow hates other things. Willow's scared of everything. Having another pet would be 100% not what Willow would want. <laughs> Padgy is very creepy. Agreed. <laughs> Okay, here we go. All right, we're here. We're here. We're ready. We're ready to roll. Actually, don't sell items. Let's haggle. We need to pick up some things from the grocery as well. Go get them, girl. We have a, like a little minute to ourselves. Excellent. We're going to sell items. Oh, she wants to cloud gaze with Archer. How sweet is she? Okay, we're going to sell... All my birds of paradise. Oh, -ho! we could sell our blue egg. Why not? Sell our bottles of milk. I believe we don't, we have bottles of milk already in the fridge. Sell the cherries. We'll keep the cherries because then we can like make more money on the choco berries. The eggs will sell. We have so many and they're probably gonna all go bad if we don't sell them. Friendly treats, we're keeping those. Onions, we'll, we'll sell a couple. But I honestly think we, we really we really farm them just to keep them. The pomegranates, we uh, we grow to sell. Raspberries, we'll sell. I don't think we've used that many raspberries. Roses, we're definitely selling. Wow, we've started making some bank now. Our strawberries, we'll sell. And we'll sell all our wool. Look at us! Boom, baby! That was a good haul. Okay, let's haggle again and then buy some items. <laughs> Allie, thank you so much for 100 bits. Thank you so much for purchasing some merch! I hope you enjoy that hoodie. Okay, we're gonna buy some discounted grocery items now. Okay, so we are going to buy ingredients. We're gonna buy some flour. Maybe two of them. Maybe three. Three flowers sounds good. We'll buy... I don't know how much sugar we have. So we'll buy sugar. We'll buy... What else things did I say we needed to buy? I think it was a vegetable. No, maybe it was a fruit. No, we need sugar and something else. Goodbye, little tilapia. I needed sugar and I needed something else. What was the other thing that I needed? Lettuce. Oh, lettuce. Thank you. I didn't need lettuce. Small lettuce. Excellent. We'll get like two lettuce. Actually, we've got four. Carb. Excellent. Lord. All right, we did our grocery shopping. Now we can go home. Crab. Thank Holy you for remembering nice. my awesome. lettuce friends that I needed. Team Patchy. Ooh. What? So many of you love him? Wow. Wow. Any plans to have merch warehouses in Canada? I am not the person that makes the merch. Uh, I partner with Fanjoy, so that would be a Fanjoy question. I don't know. Um, I would, I would assume I don't know um, what Fanjoy would be up to in the new year. So go bug them. <laughs> go bug them on their social medias. Okay. Let's put all our groceries away. We'll put away our cherries and our choco berries and our onions and our sugars and flowers and lettuce. Yeah, I think that's the majority of it all. So now hopefully we can cook like a lot more things. Yeah, look at all these good things we 
we can cook. Okay, amazing. Look at them. Look at them all. That makes me very happy that we can cook so many things. We do need to repair, but clearly dad does not want that job. Did you ever read to the kids or no? He did not. I think he even put it away. Because if he did read to the kids, it would have happened. All right, so let's grab the, the kid book. And then we're going to read to all of the kids. All of them. And I'm going to watch you do it so that you get your second hour of reading in. And we finish your aspiration. Go get it. No, read to the kids. Not read to yourself. What are you doing? Where are the children? No. you. It worked? Are you kidding me? It said... Okay, well, we we did it. <laughs> there were no kids there, but maybe he he shouted through the halls of the uh, of the house and then uh, and got them to all the kids. But thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you had a lot of fun this Sunday with me. I know I had fun with this family, even as chaotic as as it was. Um, <laughs> For me, I'm excited to get used to having this many kids around the house. I'm very excited when some of them start going to school. Uh, but until then, guys, I'll see you around the internet very soon. I'll see you Tuesday. Bye!